Breadtopia offers quite a variety of covered bakers to assist in your quest for awesome bread making, but the care and usage of each style is the same. Don't soak them, don't spritz them, just preheat for 20 to 30 minutes and drop your dough in. Our red clay bakers have amazing thermal properties, so heat them to 500 degrees without a care. One thing about loading the dough, some are concerned about the dough deflating when it hits the base of the baker. This is actually best prevented by trying not to overproof the dough. If the dough isn't overproofed, you can rough it up pretty good and it'll pop back in the first few minutes of baking. Let's take a look at loading dough into the various bakers. With a Dutch oven style baker like this and most of the others, put your fingers over the make-believe dough in this case while you invert the basket and then slide your fingers away in one kind of continuous steady motion. Here it is again in real life with real dough. Same thing with the oval baker. And same thing with the dome style bread cloche. Only the dough doesn't have far to go. When you're loading dough into the oblong baker, just position the proofing basket close to the edge and rotate it like this. It drops in gently enough and then you score it and bake it. I'm gonna put a plug in here for our Kevlar gloves. Good protection, good digital dexterity, great for the job. There's a whole other way of going about this that might suit you better. You can use a piece of parchment paper as a kind of sling to transport the dough. Line your proofing basket with a piece of parchment paper. And drop your dough into the basket for the second short proof. When it's ready to bake, score it right in the basket. And boom right into your hot baker. This parchment paper is designed for multiple uses at lower temps, but at 500 degrees where I bake this, it's a single use application. At super high temps, as you can see, this parchment paper can get pretty crispy and it uh, might stick a bit to the crust. but in this case it didn't. Another question that comes up is about preventing the dough from sticking to the baker. Fully preheating the baker before dropping the dough in prevents the dough from sticking. I preheat for 25 to 30 minutes and never have a problem with sticking. If you don't want to preheat your baker, use the parchment paper sling technique. I hope this video helps. Let us know if you have any questions.